blowing up. And I know to a lot of people that are, you know, YouTube savvy or whatever, it's probably not. But to me, it is. Like, it's already had 47 views in, like, a day. So, well, I guess almost two, two days by now, day and a half. So anyway, thank you all for watching my weekly vlog. That was so neat to see that many views. When I open my YouTube analytics, like the first little dashboard page, it gives me little fireworks because it's saying like, yay, celebration because it's doing so good. So anyway, that's a lot of fun for me. Thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting me. Um, I can also see on my analytics that over half the views are people that are not subscribed. So, if you're watching my videos, please subscribe to my channel. Um, that really helps me out a lot for other people to see my content if you're subscribed. Um, so, if you feel inclined, please subscribe to my channel. I would absolutely love if you did that. Um, plus, it'll notify you and let you know when I have new videos come out. Anyways, yeah, I just wanted to pop on and thank you guys for that. It's actually 5.13 in the evening. I'm almost home, but I... I don't know, I was just thinking about my day and then I was like, I haven't even vlogged today. So I figured I'd jump on here before I get home and get tangled up in the mess of everything, <laughs> laundry and dinner and everything. Okay, I'm gonna stop rambling. I just wanna jump on here and say, hey, happy Monday, thanks for watching. You guys are so precious and I just, I love that you're watching my videos. It just makes me feel so stinking special. So thank you, I love you guys and I'll catch you back up later. Oh, I just got home. I checked the mail, but when I got out of my car, um, Scotty was working on something and I wanted to show you guys what he's doing. So I'll start there. That's of course our house, the back door. And then we've got this conduit coming out here so we can have internet and TV out in his shop. So there's Scotty. He said he's not talking on this. <laughs> so there he is, but here's his shop. And, um, so the conduit runs all the way out and into the shop. And since it's wet right now, but not soppy, he's um, getting it buried. And so then once it's buried all the way to the house, sorry, you're probably going to get seasick from me walking around, but um, we got given all these rocks a couple of years ago and the plan has been to build a walkway. So you can see this is where I park and it's kind of wet and mucky there. So he's going to build a walkway from this door and then out there and then a step down so he can go feed the chickens over there and then all along this edge and then all the way up and over to the back door so once he gets that walkway in then I'll be able to park right beside it get out onto the walkway and not have to walk through the mud from my car so I'm kind of excited so I'm excited that he's working on that today and thanks Scotty oh, oh he talked <laughs> he's already done yeah. It's buried. Look at there. That's where the rock will cover all that. Oh, the, the walkway will come all the way up to that? Yep. Sweet. So it'll be like instead of a step off the porch? Yeah, it should be. Oh, nice. Because, yeah, see, it's a step down there. Very nice. Progress. I didn't know he was going to start laying rock tonight. I came out to get him for dinner and... I didn't know I was going to do rock tonight either. <laughs> Just got on a on a roll, huh? Yeah. That's so exciting. A bit of energy, I guess. Mm -hmm. So he's got the path all spray painted over there. All the way. Um, yep. And then now it's even straight off the porch onto the rock. It's so exciting. Hi. Uh, <laughs> what am I saying? I don't even know. It's late. I don't even know if I have vlogged in the house tonight. I really don't remember. I think I've only vlogged stuff outside with Scotty um, working on the walkway, which he got really far. It's so exciting. I can go peek out there real quick in a minute and show you. But it's like 10, 10.53, I think. I didn't actually just look at my watch, but right before we turned my camera on, I, I did look at the clock. But anyway, what I've been doing tonight is working on some shoes. And I love doing shoes, don't get me wrong, but I'm like really stumped. Like, I don't know this content at all. Like, 
I'm not familiar with this movie franchise and I'm just trying to work off of internet pictures because I don't really, I've never watched these movies. And so um, the reason I'm being so vague is because I'm actually filming it and it's going to be a video coming out. So you'll see that soon, but just, I don't know what's making it not look right. And I'm getting a little discouraged. So I'm going to walk away from it for the night. Like I said, it's almost 11 o'clock. So I'm just going to go take a shower and go to bed and work on it again tomorrow night. Anyways. Yeah, that's how I ended my night tonight was working on those and um I got my ministry Monday posted and it's not doing very well and I was just so excited about how good my um vlog was working so but I feel like the Lord is telling me to post the ministry Monday videos and so I'm gonna keep doing it no matter how good or bad they do they're at least getting some views and that means there's somebody seeing a message from God that they maybe wouldn't have seen otherwise. So I'm just going to hold tight to that, that the Lord has brought me to it and um, not get discouraged by the low views because even one person seeing it is a seed being planted and that's what's important. So, okay, I'm going to get up here. My contacts are dry. That's why I'm all winky and blinky. Um, but yeah, that's all. Good night. Good morning. Happy Tuesday. Um, I am home, as you can tell. Um, it's almost noon and I just got out of bed, but I got up this morning and got um, the kids up for school and everything. Well, Aiden Riley already gets herself up and everything, but um, I could hardly stand. I, don't, I was so dizzy, like my head was pounding. It's still actually kind of pounding. Um, I don't know what the heck's going on. I still have taste and smell, so I don't think it's COVID or anything, but, um, I got my big thing of water here and I just took some ibuprofen, but I, once I got them up and Scotty got up, I was like, I'm going back to bed. I can't do it. Like I couldn't see the light of day, which makes me wonder if it was like a migraine, which I've only had like two others in my life. So, um, but I can now stand to be in the light of day in the, in the living room. Um, so it's definitely lessened, but yeah, I don't know what's going on. I just, my head is just throbbing, pounding. I don't want to stay in bed. My back hurts from laying down in bed. So I had to get up and come in here, but, um, yeah, so I don't know. <laughs> I'm actually home alone. Just me and the animals. Cause, um, Scotty went into work today and of course the kids are in school. So I'm just going to have a day where I just sit here and, um, normally when I'm home, I always, no matter what, do stuff. I just walked into the laundry room. I was like, I'm going to at least start a little laundry. Well, there was a basket on top of the washing machine and I'm like, I don't even have the strength to pick that up right now. <laughs> so I just came in here and got my water and took some ibuprofen. Um, I felt slightly dehydrated yesterday. I drank, um, probably similar to this size cup. You've seen my Minnie Mouse cup. Um, I take that to work with me every day and I drank three of those yesterday, which is what I should be drinking anyways. But lately, um, I've only been getting one in, so I actually got three yesterday. Um, but yeah, so am I dehydrated? Um, is that what's causing my headache? I, I really don't know. So anyway, I am just going to lay here. I'm going to watch some YouTube videos on the TV. Um, Kim Wadsworth put out a new, um, it's like 42 minutes long and I can't wait to watch it because she's so hilarious. But, um, so I'm going to watch her and just try and sip this water and see if that helps. But yuck, I don't feel good. I don't have fever. So that's also a good thing, but yeah, that's my day right now so far. Hope you're having a better day than I. So anyway. Hey guys, happy Wednesday. It's, um, 12 11 in the afternoon and I'm headed home <laughs> so I went to work this morning and well backwards I got up this morning and still had a dull headache but I wasn't dizzy like I was yesterday so I went ahead and went on into work and um, really felt fine for the first 30 minutes <laughs> Um, and then literally I turned my head too fast and started feeling dizzy. And then, like, if you know me, you 
know I'm a fast walker. Like, I just, I walk fast. This guy at work says, uh, he's a runner, I've talked about him before, but he says, run fast, walk slow, because every time I walk anywhere with him in the office, he's like, why you gotta walk so fast? Another thing about walking fast, I, we took our youth group to Silver Dollar City one time, and I was like very pregnant. I want to say like eight months pregnant, but maybe I was more like six or seven months. Anyways, I was pregnant, and I was just walking, and everyone, I just got honked at. I'm going 30 in a 35. Poor guy. His horn wasn't very loud, though. Anyways, um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, those kids were like, um, slow down, Miss Ivy, slow down. And I'm like, y'all, if I can walk this fast being pregnant, you can surely keep up with me being teenagers. So, anyways, yeah, I'm normal. I normally walk fast. That's the point of all of that. So, I got up to go do something. Didn't think about it. Walked where I was going. Started walking back. And my boss was walking with me. And I about hit the floor. I just got so dizzy. And he had, he's like, okay, you need to stop. <laughs> just hang on a second, catch your breath. So we got back to my office and sat down and he's like, okay, you gonna make it? I was like, yeah. I just, I think I walked too fast. I got up too fast. So, so Anyway, sitting at my desk, I just trying to make all my movements super slow and steady and, um, sorry, I know I'm probably super boring to you guys right now because I'm talking slow and steady, but, so I, um, trying to even just scroll through my reports and stuff, which of course is just line after line of stuff, and it was like, that was making me dizzy. I'm like, okay, I can't just sit here. And do nothing, you know, so I, I'm just leaving. So he said, yes, go home, take care of yourself. Everybody at work is just awesome. They're like praying for you, go home, get well. So uh, anyway, that's what I'm doing. I'm headed home and I'm not in a hurry about it. And if anyone else would like to honk at me, feel free. Hey guys, happy Thursday. Oh my, it has been a week. Like it has flown by week. I don't have a whole lot of words about this week, <laughs> except I'm fixing to say a whole bunch of things. Um, so I honestly don't remember what I have vlogged the last two days because I have not been well. I thankfully feel so much better today. I have talked to several people and they think that I probably have vertigo. I don't know if I said this yesterday or not. I honestly don't remember. Sorry if I'm being redundant. Um, and from what I've looked up, I also agree with that. I also am not fully convinced that it wasn't a migraine, which I've only had one like super bad migraine and then a couple of others that were slightly bad. I know people that suffer from migraines, debilitating, I'm not trying. To, so that's why I think maybe it wasn't a migraine. I don't know, anyways. Um, so, I guess we'll see if it's vertigo. I, I assume it's going to come and go for the rest of my life or for the next little while because my mom had it in her 40s and now she does not suffer from it um, nearly as bad. So it could go on for the next 20 to 30 years. Who knows? Um, but anyhow, I, I forget that I'm getting older. I forget that I'm almost 40. Like, I do not feel almost 40 mentally, somewhat physically. I definitely am getting there. Um, but, you know, you see those memes all the time, like when you're waiting for mom to cook dinner and you realize you're the mom, like, I feel that so strong. And then also like, you're, something happens and you're like looking for the adult in this situation and it's like, oh wait, I am an adult. Like, I can deal with this, like, because I'm an adult, I should probably, but I don't want to because I don't want to be the adult in this situation. So anyway, let me know if you guys feel that for sure. But. Um, I feel a hundred and ten percent better. I mean, I honestly, I feel so good today. 
And I guess just from being like down for two days just makes me feel even better than I did before I didn't feel good, if that makes sense to you. Um, so I do feel really good today and I'm very thankful for that. But it's been a very busy day. So today was Miss Virginia's funeral, which is always sad to lose somebody, but it was such a joyous celebration of her life and to have sung her songs with our congregation and with um, friends from times past like it was actually very precious and I, I am very very blessed and thankful that I got to be there today and be a part of it and feel well and be able to experience that so it was very precious and I'm so thankful so um, anyways I went to work today <laughs> so I, I didn't go Tuesday I left at lunch yesterday today is Thursday I went for about an hour and a half. So I got there at 110 and then I talked to my boss for a couple minutes. So I started working about 115 and then we left at 245 because um, my work is breaking ground on a new building. We went over there. Well, everybody went over there for the groundbreaking ceremony that was at 315. And it was supposed to last till 420. We were done at 335. So we all just got to go home. So I was like, okay, well, I haven't been there in a day and a half. And I was there for an hour and a half today. So anyway, that was a lot of fun. So I've been with the company seven years, a little over seven years. It started in 2011. And um, I started in 2013. So I, I'm two years in on, on the newness of the company. And so from the time I've been there, I started in 2013 in their garage. And I was their first in-house sewer. Up until then, they had like contracted out the work. Um, people would come and get it and take it home and sew it. And so I was the first one to start sewing there. And now I manage a team of up to 20 people. Right now we're a little bit low. If you recall last week's, uh, last Friday's incident. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go back and watch week two weekly vlog. Oh, okay, so... Uh, now I manage a, a really big team. So we went from the garage to a small-ish building um, within a year of me being there. And then, actually it was less than a year. It was like June of 14 when we moved there. And then I think it was like April of 15 when we moved into our current building. And now we're already outgrown it and going to build a building. And so we should be in that building by 2022. So like any of that matters to you guys but it's just really cool to be on the ground floor of a company and just continue to just it just grow and grow and grow and grow so it's a lot of fun so anyways um that's been my day so far but it is now already thursday again so we're going to katie's house tonight for dinner and to hang out with them and it'll be nice to see alston because he was out of town last week so we didn't get to spend time with him so it'll be good to have him back around and get to see him and just catch up with them and have dinner and play with the kiddos and the video that went up today it hasn't gone up yet it's fixing to go up it's fixing a post I haven't uploaded and scheduled I'm excited about it was my Sam's Club haul from the other day so I hope that you guys like that and make sure you let me know if you like that kind of video so I can keep in mind and do that again in the future I love watching them I don't know why I guess it's kind of weird like to see what people's groceries are but I like that because then I the more I watch these people I'm like I trust them I think they're really cool I think they're fun we have a lot in common or um, like meals that they make or whatever um, if I've tried them then I'm like well I know I like the kind of foods that they eat so if they've tried this new thing then I want to try this new thing so I guess I'm not trying to be a copycat, but I like watching these things. So I am going to assume that you guys also like watching these things. So if you do, let me know. If you don't, let me know. And I won't do that anymore. So I'll just continue to watch them and not show you what I get and got. So anyways, I am just going to throw all that out there. I've been jabbering on way long enough. I already said I didn't have words, but now I have eight minutes worth of words. So I'm going to get off here and... Uh, I hope this vlog turns into more than just me talking for the week, but I am glad I feel better because I was like, this vlog is going to be the biggest Debbie Downer vlog 
ever created because I'm all it is is just made me oh I'm sick I don't know what I'm doing I don't know what's wrong with me uh, and now I feel better so at least that's a more upbeat me just talking to you guys so all right I'm gonna get home I'm gonna quit talking I'm gonna go bye hey guys happy Friday yay we made it through the week I didn't think it was gonna happen earlier this week oh my word Oh, goodness, that person was about to just pull right on out. Um, so I'm on my way home. It's 5.54 on Friday. I went to the grocery store right after work, and I went to just our small little local grocery store. I say local. I don't know how many harps there are, but I know there's a bunch in our area. Anyways, um, so I popped in there instead of going to Walmart because I figured on Friday it was probably insanity at Walmart. I didn't get like a full week's worth of groceries because we're not out of a ton of things, but I just got what we needed. Um, tonight we're going to have deer burgers for dinner. I'm so excited. I don't think we've had those since the summer, so I just, I can hardly wait to eat them. They're so, going to be so delicious. So Scotty's going to work on my car, so that means I have to run the grill. Normally that's his field, but he's like are you gonna run the grill? I'm like, I don't care. That's what I want to eat. So yes, I will run the grill. Um, but I also picked up stuff to uh, meal prep for next week for me. I want to make salads for every day of the week so I can just grab it and go in the mornings. So I might do that with you guys this weekend. Um, my Sam's Club grocery haul video is doing so good. It's so stinking exciting. And I have a a comment from a new person so thank you um, for the comment that's just oh, I love when you guys comment on my content so thank you for the encouragement and um, they asked for a full grocery haul this will not be it because it's not a full grocery haul but the next time I make like a complete list go through all my pantries um, pantries I only have one my pantry my fridge my whole house and just get a full grocery haul done then I will absolutely do that so thank you for the request and I would love to do that for you guys yeah I just want to pop on here oh it's so shaky it's one of the things God is gonna work on is my my brakes he says I ride my brakes too much is that a thing I mean it's safe right you're supposed to brake when you're going to slow down but I don't know <laughs> I know enough about cars that's why that's his jurisdiction for sure Okay, so it's dark, it's weird lighting, I'm just rambling, so I'm going to get out of here and I'll just catch up with you guys later. I just want to pop on and say hi. Hey guys, so I am home, I'm making dinner right now, but I just had to pop on here and just say I am so sad because I bought lettuce for one, our hamburgers tonight, and two, to prep salads, like I said earlier on. Uh, and so I opened it out of the package and I pulled off the first few leaves and then, what in the world? That is the saddest thing I've ever seen. Like, it is so gross. So, it looked fine on the outside, but it is not good on the inside. So, I'm not going to be able to pre mill, mill prep, pre-prep my salads unless I go back to town. And I didn't want to go back to town. We will probably run into town Sunday after church and go eat lunch or something. So, I might pop into neighborhood market or something while I'm in town but anyways yeah I've got my burgers on outside and I got french fries on in here that's probably what you hear there so I better go check my burgers but oh, I was so bummed about the stinking lettuce sure film while I'm not working while you're doing you're doing a good <laughs> job there Kyle <laughs> sure pays off having family members that know what they're doing and have awesome tools yeah. yep yep so nice. Hi guys, it's Saturday. It's 4.38 on Saturday evening, afternoon, whatever you call it. Um, and I just realized I haven't vlogged at all today. Um, I haven't done a whole lot of anything today. I have been so distracted all day long. I keep going back and forth. So I'm trying to work on my closet, as you can see. Yay me. Um, except I've been trying to do it for hours. Um, so I did a project in Riley's room. I can go show you that in a second. It's kind of fun. So I was like, okay, I have got to get back to this closet because my bed is completely covered with stuff, which you'll have to watch that video coming out, hopefully Thursday, um, and see my closet renovation, but not renovation, just clean out, whatever. 
organization. And yeah, I just keep getting distracted. It was like rainy and yucky and now the sun's out, but it's thundering. And so I don't know what today's going to end up being, but I've got to get this closet done and I've got to figure out dinner and all the things. So I just wanted to pop on here and say, Hey, okay. So I don't have a before, but this used to be like one of those like French frames or whatever that has like the crisscross. I had made that to put her pictures on of her, all of her friends. So we just recovered it in a different colored fabric and those black things are just push pins. And then we just hung her paintings, her artwork. So yeah, that's what we did earlier. And then there's Lila and Riley and Brooklyn. <laughs> Say hi, Brooklyn. This is my weekly vlog. Hey. <laughs> and then Riley and um, Lila are painting right now. Okay, so I'm sitting here going through all the pictures I just took out of my closet. And I got an imminent danger alert on my phone. Apparently there's thunderstorms on the horizon. But they're so dirty. Excuse the dust. But how precious is this? Oh, I also remembered I wanted to say, I on this vlog as I was editing last night, Monday night, I was discouraged because my ministry Monday only had a few views or whatever. I should have known because God is so good. And that's what I said during that. I'm like, if I'm just, um, if I even reach one person with my ministry Monday, I'm doing my part. I'm planting the seed. I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. That video now has 80 views. Like, <laughs> so exciting. So just calm, calm down, Ivy, like cool your tool. It's fine. Um, my video that went up Thursday was my Sam's club shop with me and it has 96 views. Like you guys are amazing. And like, you're blowing my mind and I'm so stinking excited and I love it. And I appreciate you. And oh, I'm loving every second of this YouTube journey. It's so much fun. So, okay. I better quit rambling. So, uh, you guys are liking watching my videos. I want to keep it. <laughs> keep it like that and not have like hour long videos every week. So I'm going to try and keep them around 30 minutes. Anyway, I wanted to show you those few cute pictures. Look at my nephews. Again, they're so dirty because they were in my closet, but Samuel's 16 now, almost 17. And then Case is 13 with Riley. Okay. One more, one more wedding picture. Oh, it's so dusty. Look at those children beautiful our wedding was so beautiful i've been to a lot of weddings and i'm sorry to every other wedding you've ever been to but my wedding was the most beautiful and i'm sure everyone is just as biased as i am about that so anyway just wanted to show you guys some of the sweet pictures i'm finding but i'm having a good time walking down memory lane here but i need to get a move on i've done nothing else except put stuff on shelves that isn't even supposed to be there but anyway oh my gosh my camera is still going because i'm filming all this <sighs> Come on, Ivy. All right, so I'm kind of filming blind because my phone's turned around, but I'm going to start my collage wall. I have my pictures all laid out in front of me here. You can't see them, but you will see them once they get up on the wall and while they're getting put up on the wall. What I'm going to do is take masking tape, and this big one right here has like two little hooky things. So if you don't know this trick, you take the masking tape, run it across here, mark it with a pin, stick the masking tape on the wall, then you're able to hang your picture. Easy peasy. So I'm going to do that first. See, I've got it marked here. And of course my Sharpie didn't work, but I was able to mark the holes anyways. So I'm just going to kind of eyeball it. I want it kind of high, but not super high.
love this so much. I am so completely happy with it. Look how good it looks. You can't see it from here even. <laughs> okay, so let's take a walk down memory lane. This is my senior pictures. How precious are we there? This was at a wedding. This was after high school. Look how tiny my waist is. Oh my goodness. Um, let's see. This was right after high school. I was in a pageant and I had to have headshots. So we made the best of it and got a couple's photos done as well. This was right after we got engaged. You see my ring just a sparkle in right there. Oh, I love that picture. We just both look so happy. This was literally the weekend we got engaged. We went to Shogun. So, yep, me showing my ring off there. This was after we were married. Riley was about 10 months old. We went to Houston um, for my aunt and uncle's vow renewal. And that was at Galveston Beach. And then that one, Riley was about the same age. We got family pictures done. And then these are our engagement pictures. The glare is terrible, but... My cousin Amber took those. Thank you, Amber. I love them so much still. This one might be one of my absolute favorite pictures ever because I look almost exactly like my mother here. And I think my mother is like the most beautiful woman in the world. So I just love that. Love it, love it. And look how handsome Scotty is. Oh my gosh. How did I marry up like that? Gorgeous little people that we were. Y'all, this was 16 years ago. Beautiful, beautiful. But I am so completely happy with it. And then there's our wedding picture that my uncle did. And the kids made that for us. You guys see that in the back of my sit down videos because that's where I sit to do them. <laughs> and then this is our background. So there's a little behind the scenes. And then the kids made that for us one time when they stayed with their grandparents. All right, so with that, I'm going to close out this vlog. Oh, I just love it. It makes me so happy. My door is right here on the other side of this. So as soon as I walk in my bedroom, I'm going to see that. It's I love it so much. Just going through all those pictures while I was cleaning out my closet. I just, I found all of those pictures and I'm like, you know what? I want to make a collage of just us through the years. And these are all super old. I need to get some newer pictures done, but I guess the newer ones are kind of in the living room in the front end of our house. Sorry, my camera is so shaky. I don't even have a case on my phone, so I'm just holding my phone by the phone. Okay, this vlog is already going to be long enough. I'm going to go. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it all the way to the end, give me a um, purple heart emoji in the comments because I would love to know who made it to the end of this crazy vlog. It's been a wild week. What a perfect way to end it with this beautiful collage wall on my bedroom. And I'm just so, I'm so blessed. I'm such a blessed woman. I have a wonderful marriage with a wonderful husband and I'm so blessed. I'm blessed by you guys because you are just, you just make me so excited every day. Ooh, this lighting is incredible. Okay, this is better. So anyway, I appreciate you guys watching. Um, make sure you like this video, comment down below the purple heart if you made it this far, subscribe to my channel, please. I would love for you to subscribe to my channel and, um, yeah, that's all. I'm gonna go. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.